guys. Uh, I'm going to do a little review on the Redhead Reality Series Crazy Jake. Uh, it's, a, it's a battery powered uh, decoy. It just spins. Um, I purchased it for the 2014 uh, turkey season. Uh, we're we're going to put it to use this year. Uh, I, I probably won't really mess with it a whole lot until maybe mid to late season once the birds have uh, been pounded by other hunters and seen every decoy known to man. I figured it'd probably be helpful, you know, mid to late season, and, and, and especially with stubborn field birds, um, just adds a little realism to it. Um, with it moving and everything, uh, I, I think a stationary decoy that doesn't move uh, probably does more harm than good. Um, I've tried the B Mobile in the past, and uh, I've had two gobblers come out on it, and they just stay away from it because it doesn't move. But uh, I figured with this thing moving and it being a little bit smaller, it's only 70% uh, the size of a adult gobbler, so it's less intimidating and it moves. And it comes with a Jake fan. Uh, we're just going to do a review on it and I'll let you guys check it out. Uh, as you can see, it comes with the decoy bag here. Pretty handy. Um, I like that it isn't the mesh like the normal ones. Um, I like that it's a solid color, um, especially with it having this orange flag in here, like my B-Mobile decoy has the orange flag, but it's a mesh decoy, and you can see, see the bright orange flag right through it, so you gotta, you got to hide it somewhere in your vest whenever you deploy the B-Mobile, or you'll have a bright orange flag sitting next to you on the ground. Um, we're going to get this thing opened up and set it up, and I will show you it in action. Uh, just a quick rundown of everything it comes with. Like I said, the, the solid color decoy bag. Um, here's the remote stake. Uh, it has this little extra stake that you can put in on the side. It's not required, but it's basically a foot stake. You can put your foot on it to help mash it into a lot harder soils and all that. A um, little bag to put all your stakes in. Um, and then your your foldable fan. Uh, it's a little Jake fan. It'd probably look a lot better if I, if I put a real fan on it and make a Jake fan out of one but um, <clears throat> this is the decoy like I said he's only 70 percent the size of a uh, adult gobbler so it's less intimidating uh, decent little beard on it uh, they say it's trimmable so if you want to make it a little more real you can trim it up a little bit um, the fan attaches this little flap um, there's a little slot in the fan it just this uh, velcro uh, strap goes through it. Um, you put it in there and hook it in. Pretty easy. What I've uh, done instead of putting all the stakes and everything back in here, it comes with a longer stake for using without the uh, motor. But uh, I have the shorter stake already installed in the bird right here. Uh, I, I found that to store it, it's a lot easier just to lay the stake and the fan and everything in it rather than take it all apart. Um, that's just slow you down in the field when you're trying to set something up. Um, that and I just throw my other stakes in this little pouch here. Um, just leave it partially set up. Um, that way it's a lot quicker to, to, to deploy. Uh, I'm going to get it set up now.